Having connection problems with your 8-BitDo Ultimate controller on PC? Here are the essential troubleshooting steps to get your controller working properly. First, ensure your controller is charged and you've selected the correct connection mode. Make sure any USB cables or dongles are properly connected to your PC. The 8-BitDo Ultimate controller supports three connection modes, 2.4G wireless using a USB dongle, Bluetooth for direct connection, and USB cable for wired connection. For wireless connections, put the controller into pairing mode by holding the pairing button for three seconds. The indicator light will flash rapidly when the controller is ready to pair. For Bluetooth connections, make sure Bluetooth is enabled on your PC. Look for 8-Bit Do Ultimate or Pro Controller in your device list and select it to pair. A common issue is the controller disconnecting during gameplay. This can happen when you accidentally touch the mode switch on the back of the controller, so be careful to avoid this area during play. Keep your Ultimate software updated. The latest update from June 27, 2025 optimized network connections and improved firmware download speeds, which can help resolve connectivity issues. When basic troubleshooting fails, advanced fixes focus on firmware updates, software configuration, and connection protocols. The first step is updating firmware for both your controller and receiver using the official 8BitDo Ultimate software. For 2.4 GHz connections experiencing dropouts, USB 3.0 interference is often the culprit. Connect your receiver dongle through the charging station rather than directly to your PC to mitigate this interference. Bluetooth connections present unique challenges. X-Input, the standard Xbox controller API for Windows, may not work properly over Bluetooth without third-party workarounds like BetterJoy software. When software fixes fail, hardware resets can resolve persistent issues. Two reset methods are available a standard reset using pairing plus home buttons for five seconds, or a force reboot holding only the home button for eight seconds. As a final troubleshooting step, manually update firmware through the Ultimate software. This process can recover controllers that appear completely unresponsive or bricked, restoring full functionality when other methods fail.